finishing up some model railroad track work my wyoming and utah junction project this is part two we're going to finish it up today we're glad you're here let's get to work Hey everybody, this is Brian with the Iron Horse Route, home of the Denver and Rio Grande Western, welcoming you to the channel and back to part two of my Utah and Wyoming Junction project. It's good to have you here. I appreciate you coming back for part two. Thank you for stopping in. Don't forget to leave a comment at the end and let me know you're here. I'm going to put on some good jazz and let you watch the work. I'll speak to you at the end.
was going to be difficult to get shots of anyway, way over here. So I just did this, and I'm just going to show you. I have those two spurs all the way going back, and they are in there drying now. I couldn't get my pen vise in a few places, so I just used... I'm gonna put another one right here where I wanna start the bend back towards Now I'll be able to bend this guy coming back towards here. For the connection. After I saw 
after I was able to drop this down and bend this back around, I can see that I'm not having any problems here with these rails wanting to come out. They're not wanting to pull out. What that means is no more soldering because I don't solder unless I have to. These rails would have pulled out. I did a good job and I probably could do the same good job right here, but it's not necessary. And so if it ain't broke, I ain't fixing it. I could cause more damage than good. So what I've got to do is now I'm going to just come in, pin this down, connect it, and we'll be rocking and rolling on line one and from the plain view spurs. And then I will have to bring in a piece to connect from here to here.
it. <clears throat> I'm going to be pulling the pins now. I'm going to pull the pins. I'm going to clean everything up. Then I'm going to give you a, a shot from the of the logo coming through, coming through this turn out. I'm going to flip it. Back it up, we're gonna take the right side down, back up, and bring it back out, come back down and go down the other way to test it. That'll be the end of the video for today. Take care. Be right back. I use the tidy track rail cleaning kit by Woodman Phoenix. I won on Sparky Drive. This first one is for uh, glue etc. when you can work it. I'm going to run it with four pads. I normally use another pad, but I'm so low on goo gone that I'm gonna skip it today. I hope I don't need it. I might not ever need it, but this is just, uh, this is actually, I think, 70 or something, because I refilled it. So what I do is I wet those pads, because uh, I'm out of the cleaner that comes with it. And I do dab it to make sure that I don't have excess. Alright, so the train's going to be coming through on its way back down from Winter Park. It's uh, about to head this way now. And I got turnout here, turnout here. What I'm going to have happen is the loco is going to come through here on its way east to Denver. Here in Plainview, it's going to come across this turnout here. I'm going to stop the loco. I'm going to flip the turnout here. And I'm hoping that the loco will back up and roll down line one. Line one, which will actually head to Utah, if I'm not mistaken. I'll have to check on that, but I think that's what it is. And we'll roll it back down there by the sawmill and bring it back up. We'll stop it again here. I will flip this switch and we will reverse down the line towards Wyoming. And we will back up down there by the sawmill and we will come back up. And so here comes the uh, said loco right now. We're going to slow him down coming through here. He's moving a little quick. And as he comes through, I'm going to put the brakes on him. We're gonna flip this turnout. I already have the turnout set for uh, line one. And here we go, let's see if it works. We got Loco backing up there, Loco backing up there, through the re-railer. Looks like it's going for now. Looks like we might have a successful S down line one. Here we come back out. We're gonna come back out on the slope. I will 
to stop her there. This is Avery's loco. Must be why it's working. I said that and I'm gonna jinx it. Now we're gonna try to go down line two. We got through there, all right. Let's see if we can get through that re-railer, all right. We did. Got a little spot down there I'm a little worried about, but it rolled through. Back, 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 back. We may have successful test two. Here we come. And I will run this bad boy back down to Denver as we had a successful test. And what I gotta do, gotta remember to flip the switch on my main line. Thanks for coming in and watching today. I appreciate it. If you would, leave me a comment so I know you are here. If you like the video, please make sure you click the like button. If you have not already, I want to encourage you to subscribe. Click the bell icon and share this with your other modeling friends. Have another, have another upload coming out in a couple weeks. I hope to see y'all back here then.